Today we're gonna to be going over how to check and adjust the feed chain tension on a PowerRock T45 and a PowerRock T35. You wanna have your drifter at the top of the feed. Once your drifter is at the top of the feed, you can check your tension bolts are here on the top and the bottom. With the drifter at the top, you wanna take your measurement from the dead middle of the feed or the lowest sag point of the feed chain. The measurement you'll take is from the base of the feed to the top of the chain and you want that measurement around 40 millimeters or just shy of an inch and a half. If you do need to make adjustments to your feed chain tension, you'll use these bolts right here. So to adjust your sprocket down, you will want to loosen this lock nut and tighten this, bolt, this nut here to push the sprocket down. To bring the sprocket up, you'll want to loosen the top nut and tighten the bottom one. Once your adjustment is correct, you will wanna make sure that your measurements of thread on the bottom and on the top match the same adjustment bolt on the other side to prevent any binding of the sprocket. If adjustment is needed to be made to the feed chain, using these two nuts here on the bottom for the adjustment, you're gonna use an inch and 13 16 wrench to either loosen the top nut or loosen the bottom nut and vice versa for the adjustment. As always, if you ever have any further questions, you can reference your operations manual for the machine or contact your local service center.